one of the most customizable custom home named as ancient os is now updating and the latest version which i'm using right now is 7.4.1 based on android 13 it's not based you know based on android 14 yet it will based on it will be available based on android 14 very very soon but not sure about all the customizations maybe it will take some time but for now as this is ancient os version 7.4.1 this is the version 13 which is based of course android 13 i'm talking about and it is having the security patch from october which means it's the latest version november security patch based some custom homes are coming but for now a lot of custom homes are based on october security patch and this is one of them which are the features and great things included in this custom room we will talk about all of those those things in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end first one is the status bar style which we have we have three styles if you include the default one the one which i'm using right now is ipong style the names are quite weird but as you can see this is how my status bar is looking like we also have some custom switch styles available you have many options available like doraemon deadpool we have ios style we have on off yes no smile pikachu whichever you want to choose on off looks good kind of so this is what i'm using right now you can use any other if you want to it it's totally up to you if i move on to quick settings panel you have the option for android 11 style tiles which is also good looking it's it's not that bad android 11 style quick setting tiles and also in the light quick settings panel this this looks quite good this looks actually better if i move on to the other options or customizations as this custom brings you a lot of customizations in quick settings we also have the ancient brightness percentage option if you enable this option in the brightness side you will be able to notice how many how much percentage your brightness is as you can see my device percentage is 77 brightness percentage basically i'm talking about 77 percent 88 so this could be the exact value which you need to find out if you move on to fingerprint options you will notice disable fingerprint lockout option is available which simply deactivates the 30 second timeout as well as a permanent lockout after multiple failed fingerprint unlock attempts this feature is quite useful especially if you're a custom room user this is so useful i always enable this option one of the features which is available here is google services which you can disable by default if your device has the google play services enabled you can simply disable and remove all the google play services even including google play store i'm not exactly sure about google play store but google core apps and google services will be disabled if you enable this option and as you can see i think so even find my device will be turned off not exactly sure parallel space is also included and uh, this is i think so better than as compared to the normal new app cloner which is available in android 14 based custom rooms this could be a better choice because in this if you enable parallel space you have approximately five options available you can create up to five parallel spaces i'm not exactly sure but you can and you also have the option for the google play services as an optional thing or you can simply disable this if you don't want that you can create up to five instances of that particular app while as an app cloner which is based, which is available in android 14 you can't create more than one so that could be the thing in miscellaneous option you also can see use storage encryption spoofing this looks good you can simply spoof your storage encryption status to encrypted by default if your device storage is decrypted you can spoof it as we have many spoofing options available this could be one of them i found in one of my comment box from one user i, I found the comment where he was talking about encryption spoofing and uh, this is available in this ancient os custom room we also have the ignore secure window flag option which is so useful as we are talking about some spoofing options we also have the option to unlock the higher fps in games for the gamers if you need this thing it's present here we also have the google camera spoofing option available which will simply enable some extra features in a google camera but depends upon which device you are using so as you can see some features require hardware compatibility we also have the unlimited photo storage option available which simply spoof your device as pixel excel for google photos app only to provide unlimited storage for backup i most of the times use this feature it's available it's so useful last but not the least netflix spoofing option is also present we also have some developer options like signature spoofing which you can enable i'm not exactly sure if it will work or not but depends upon which device you're using it it should work for sure 
if you move on to notification options notifications have the re ticker notification option which is so useful you can simply replace your notifications with a redesigned version of tickers it, it's a replacement of heads up notifications heads up notifications are available everywhere but you can disable that and enable re-ticker notifications i use this feature especially if it is available in my customer by default i always use this feature this is absolutely so useful including this one we also have volume percentage in the volume panel in the button section if you enable this option so as you can see whenever i increase or decrease my volume i can see the real percentage this looks good this actually looks good it's same like the brightness slider which i just shown you a few minutes ago but it's same with the volume percentage too i need to enable this option if it is available this this is so useful in this case you also have the option to change the location for that percentage right now it is at top you can choose at bottom also if you move on to the gestures option you will see one of my favorite features which is named as hide ime button space it simply remove the space below the keyboard by default if you use gestures in keyboard below keyboard you have some space available disable that space but you don't want to disable the pill then this option is useful i always use this feature and if it is not available by default you can simply use a magic module for that the magic module name is small keyboard navbar i think so it should work and i always use that feature i always use that that module and it also works with android 14 too so that's good we also have the option for status bar height for example if you use dual status bar as this feature is available in ancient OS. so in that case if you want to adjust the status bar height default is there 35 dp 50 60 80 depends upon which device you're using you can choose according to that of course by default is by default but if you want to change you can choose this feature this is this could be useful thing for some of the users especially if you are a dual status bar user if you move on to the settings base layout style option in the theming section you have the option to choose that as you can see i have enabled the one ui style this is how it is looking like looks better i guess but if you have the option to choose something else for example 11 style then this will be changed and this is how the looking ui will be looking like if you move on here and send features as you can see now it is no more looking like one ui but yes of course it's optional this is just based on customization it's not a feature at all but if you still want to check it out you can it, it's available for you in battery styles you will see we have many battery styles available one of my favorite is ios 16 style this is what i'm using right now but you already have some other options for example if you move on to this windows as you can see we have the window style we also have the miui style ios 14 style battery indicator is also present we also have the color OS style we have baseball style we have many styles available color OS style is also good looking so we have many battery icon styles available you can choose any one of them there are many options available for you in the terms of customizations as all the customizations are already available this is one of those customer which brings you insane number of customizations you can simply go and explore if it is available for your device launcher etc everything is customizable go and check it out these were things i just wanted to let you know if you want to install this link is already available in the description thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one until then goodbye